Welcome to our journey through the cosmos. As we embark on this interstellar voyage, we invite you to buckle up and prepare for a ride that's out of this world. Today, we're setting our sights on a phenomenon that often goes unnoticed, yet its effects are far-reaching and profound. We're talking about space weather, the atmospheric conditions within our solar system, primarily dictated by the sun's activity. You might have heard about solar flares or cosmic rays, but have you ever stopped to consider how they impact our lives here on Earth? If not, you're in for a surprise. From the technology we use daily to the very fabric of our existence, the sun's activity influences our world in ways you wouldn't believe. So stick around as we unravel the surprising impacts of space weather on Earth, our lives, and the world around us. Let's set sail on this cosmic journey. Have you ever considered how the weather in space can impact our lives here on Earth? Welcome to the intriguing world of space weather, a concept that extends beyond the confines of our atmosphere and into the vast expanse of the cosmos. You might be wondering, what exactly is space weather? Well, think of it as the atmospheric conditions within our solar system, dictated primarily by the sun's activity. It's a cosmic ballet of solar flares, cosmic rays, and charged particles, creating a dynamic and unpredictable environment. Now, you might be thinking, sure, it sounds fascinating, but how does it affect me? The answer to that might surprise you. Space weather isn't just about spectacular auroras lighting up the polar skies. It's also about the real-world consequences that can occur when these celestial phenomena interact with our planet. Imagine for a moment our Earth as a ship sailing through the cosmic ocean. The sun, our star, is continuously emitting a solar wind a stream of charged particles that engulfs our planet. This solar wind interacts with Earth's magnetic field, creating a variety of effects, some of which are stunningly beautiful, like the auroras, and others that can be disruptive to our technology-dependent society. In fact, intense solar activity can cause geomagnetic storms that can knock out power grids, disrupt satellite communications, and even impact airline passenger safety. And that's just the tip of the cosmic iceberg. From influencing weather patterns to affecting animal behavior and even posing a threat to astronauts, space weather permeates various aspects of our lives in ways we are only beginning to understand. So as we stand on the precipice of a new era of space exploration, understanding space weather becomes not just a matter of scientific curiosity, but a necessity for our survival and progress in this vast universe. Now let's delve into the 10 surprising ways space weather affects our planet. At number 10, we have the impact on satellite communications. Imagine this, you're driving to an unfamiliar place, relying on your GPS to guide you, when suddenly it starts acting up. Or you're sitting down for a night of binge watching your favorite show, but your satellite TV keeps losing signal. It's frustrating, right? Well, you might have space weather to thank for that. You see, solar storms, which are essentially massive explosions on the sun, can send waves of charged particles hurtling towards Earth. When these particles collide with our planet's magnetic field, they can cause disruptions in satellite signals. This leads to interruptions in services we often take for granted, like GPS and satellite TV. So if you find yourself lost on a road trip or missing the crucial last minutes of a gripping drama, don't be too quick to blame your devices. Next time your GPS goes haywire, you might just blame it on the sun. Coming in at number nine, we have the effect on power grids. This is where the drama of space weather really hits home. Imagine, if you will, a geomagnetic storm. This is a temporary disturbance of the Earth's magnetosphere caused by a solar wind shock wave. Now, this storm doesn't just stay up there in the cosmos, oh no. It interacts with the Earth's magnetic field and can induce currents right down here on the ground. These currents are not something our power grids are designed to handle. They can overload the system, causing transformers to fail, and in extreme cases, result in wide-scale blackouts. Picture the bustling city at night, suddenly plunged into darkness. It's not a scene from a blockbuster movie, but a real-life possibility. Space weather is not just about beautiful auroras. It can have serious implications for our everyday life. It's quite startling to think that a solar storm could plunge us into darkness, isn't it? At number eight, we have the risk to airline passengers. A fascinating yet often overlooked fact is that space weather can impact airline travel. Cosmic rays, 
high energy particles originating from space constantly bombard Earth. While our planet's magnetic field and atmosphere protect us on the ground, things change when we fly. Airline passengers and crew, especially on polar routes, are more exposed to these cosmic rays. The higher altitude and latitude mean less atmospheric protection, so radiation exposure increases. It's not something to lose sleep over, as the additional radiation dose on a typical flight is still quite small. However, it's a factor airlines and regulatory bodies consider, particularly for flight crew members who spend many hours in the sky. So whether it's a short hop or a long haul flight, remember that the effects of space weather accompany us. So space weather can even affect us when we're flying high in the sky. At number seven, we have the impact on weather patterns. Now this is where things get really interesting. Scientists have been theorizing that solar activity could be a significant influence on Earth's climate and weather patterns. Imagine a solar storm, a burst of charged particles from the sun reaching our planet. These particles can interact with Earth's magnetic field, potentially causing shifts in atmospheric pressure and temperature. Some researchers suggest that particularly intense solar activity could even contribute to phenomena like El Nino, a climate pattern that significantly affects global weather. But it's crucial to remember this is still an area of ongoing research. We're just beginning to scratch the surface of understanding how the sun's activity influences our world. It's a fascinating topic that keeps scientists on their toes, always eager to uncover more about our universe. The sun's activity could be playing a bigger role in our weather than we thought. Coming in at number six, the effect on animal behavior. It's a fascinating fact that some animals, like birds and sea turtles, have an inbuilt compass. They use Earth's magnetic field for navigation. So when they migrate thousands of miles across continents and oceans, they rely on this magnetic map to guide them. But guess what? Space weather, particularly solar storms, can disrupt this. Solar storms cause a sudden surge in Earth's magnetic field strength and can lead to what is known as geomagnetic storms. Now imagine being a bird or a sea turtle in the middle of such a storm. Your internal compass goes haywire and you could end up off course, potentially by hundreds of miles. It's like trying to navigate through a maze with a faulty map. This is just one of the many ways that space weather affects life here on Earth. So space weather could even throw our wildlife off course. At number five, we have the threat to astronauts. When we think about astronauts, we often imagine them floating in the zero gravity environment of space, conducting important research and exploring the unknown. But there's a less charming side to this picture, and that's the significant risk space weather poses to these brave explorers. Events like solar flares and cosmic rays can expose astronauts to harmful radiation. This radiation not only poses a health risk, but can also interfere with the astronauts' equipment, potentially damaging crucial spacecraft systems. Without the protection of Earth's atmosphere, astronauts are at the mercy of these unpredictable space weather phenomena. Additionally, high energy particles from the sun can cause a variety of problems for spacecraft, from minor technical glitches to serious system failures. This poses an additional layer of risk for astronauts who rely on their spacecraft for survival. Being an astronaut is a risky business and space weather is one of those risks. At number four, we have the impact on technology. Space weather isn't just an astronomical curiosity. It has tangible effects on our day-to-day -day technology. Solar storms, for instance, can create electromagnetic disturbances that interfere with radio signals. This can lead to disruptions in anything that relies on radio waves, from your favorite FM station to the GPS system guiding your car. But the influence of space weather extends beyond the airwaves. It also affects operations underground. For instance, fluctuations in Earth's geomagnetic field caused by solar activity can interfere with drilling operations. These disturbances can cause drilling equipment to veer off course, leading to costly errors. Our technological world is more intertwined with space weather than you might think. It's a relationship that scientists and engineers are constantly working to understand better, to mitigate potential disruptions and safeguard our tech-dependent society. So next time your radio signal is fuzzy, it could be the sun's fault. Coming in at number three, the influence on human health. Space weather's effects aren't just limited to our technology and the world around us. They might be more personal than you'd imagine. 
There are theories suggesting that cosmic rays, solar flares, and other space phenomena could have an impact on our body's internal systems. Sleep, for instance, could be influenced by geomagnetic activity. Some studies suggest that during periods of high solar activity, people may experience disrupted sleep patterns. Now, imagine the impact of an unsettled sleep schedule on your daily life, but it doesn't stop there. Cardiovascular health, a vital aspect of our well-being, could also be affected. Some researchers have observed connections between periods of intense solar and geomagnetic activity and increased rates of heart attacks and strokes. Could the sun be affecting our health? It's a fascinating thought. The universe around us might be more intertwined with our daily lives than we ever realized. At number two, we have the impact on Earth's magnetic field. Now, when we talk about space weather, we can't ignore the magnetic field of our Earth. It's our first line of defense against the onslaught of solar storms. You see, solar storms are intense bursts of radiation coming from the release of magnetic energy stored in the sun. They're usually accompanied by solar flares and coronal mass ejections, or CMEs. These are massive bubbles of gas and magnetic field that get ejected from the sun over several hours. When these solar storms hit Earth, they interact with our planet's magnetic field, causing temporary disturbances known as geomagnetic storms. These aren't your run-of-the-mill thunderstorms. No, these are cosmic events happening right above our heads. During a geomagnetic storm, charged particles from the sun disrupt the steady state of our magnetic field. This can result in fluctuations that alter the direction of the field and cause it to wobble. The effects of these geomagnetic storms can be quite significant. They can interfere with satellite communications, affect power grids, and even cause beautiful displays of auroras or northern and southern lights. While these lights are a delightful sight, they stand as a stark reminder of the power of solar storms and their ability to shake our magnetic field. But it's not all doom and gloom. You see, our magnetic field is quite resilient. It has been dancing with solar storms for billions of years, and for the most part, it does an excellent job of deflecting these charged particles, protecting us from harmful solar and cosmic radiation. However, it's important to remember that our magnetic field isn't invincible. As our understanding of space weather continues to grow, so does our appreciation for the delicate balance that exists between the sun, our magnetic field, and life on Earth. So the next time you look up at the night sky, take a moment to appreciate the invisible shield that is our magnetic field. It's more than just a line of defense. It's a dynamic, living entity that is constantly interacting with the cosmos. Our planet's magnetic field is our shield against space weather, but it's not invincible. And finally, at number one, we have the potential for future disasters. As we delve deeper into the cosmos, our understanding of space weather and its impacts continues to grow. But so too does our apprehension of what a major space weather event could mean for our modern world. Imagine, if you will, the year 1859. Telegraph systems across Europe and North America fail, some even catching fire. Auroras, usually reserved for those near the poles, light up the night sky even as far south as the Caribbean. This was the Carrington event, the most powerful solar storm recorded in human history. Fast forward to today. Our reliance on technology is far greater than it was in the mid-19th century. A solar storm of similar magnitude to the Carrington event could have devastating effects. Satellites, the backbone of our global communication network, could be knocked out. Power grids could fail, plunging entire continents into darkness. The economic cost of such an event is estimated to be in the trillions of dollars. But it's not all doom and gloom. Our understanding of space weather is improving all the time. Scientists are working tirelessly to improve our ability to predict solar storms and to harden our infrastructure against them. We are, in many ways, in a race against the sun. While we cannot stop a solar storm from happening, we can prepare for it. We can build resilience into our power grids, develop backup communication systems, and design satellites to withstand intense solar radiation. It's a challenge, certainly, but it's one that we're capable of meeting. And in the face of this potential disaster, we're reminded of our place within the larger cosmos. We're not just inhabitants of Earth, but citizens of the universe subject to its laws and its weather. So there you have it, 10 surprising ways that space weather can affect Earth. It's a reminder of how interconnected our planet is with the cosmos. As we conclude this cosmic exploration, we understand that we're not mere spectators in this expansive universe. 
We are involved. We are voyagers, frontier explorers of the cosmos. Our choices and actions today will dictate our response to the challenges posed by space weather. As we untangle the enigmas of the cosmos, we must always keep in mind that knowledge is might. It falls on our shoulders to educate ourselves, to adapt, and to be ready. This isn't a mission for an individual or a single nation. This is a combined endeavor, one that needs the teamwork of scientists, engineers, policymakers, and individuals just like you. So, what can you do? The first step is staying informed. Keep acquiring knowledge about space, about our planet, and about the universe we all call home. Then disseminate that knowledge. Share it with your comrades, your family, your local communities. It's crucial that we initiate a worldwide dialogue about space weather and its effect on our everyday lives. And lastly, help us propagate the message. If you learned something new from our journey through the cosmos, do leave a like and share your thoughts in the comment section. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon to stay updated with our future videos. Share this video with your friends and family. Remember, we're all in this together, navigating through the cosmos. Remember, we're not simply Earth dwellers, but universe citizens. Therefore, let's keep exploring, studying, and adapting. Because united, we can confront any obstacle the cosmos presents. Thank you accompanying us on this journey, and until we meet again, keep gazing at the stars.